My name is Matt King and I work as an accessibility specialist here at Facebook headquarters. I lost most of my vision when I was studying electrical engineering at the University of Notre Dame and that's when I first started having to use a screen reader to access computers and I enjoyed the technology and what it could do for me but I was always frustrated with what it couldn't do for me. Right now there's a huge information gap uh, present on the internet for people who cannot see photos. My name is Jeffrey Whelan. My current job is uh, the head of accessibility at Facebook. Making sure that people with disabilities have equal access to our platforms uh, and to the internet is something that we care a lot about and something that we think is important for the world. I do not think that we will connect everybody in the world unless we are tackling accessibility really robustly. It's really important for us to understand what users want. Getting more feedback and understanding other people is the most important part of the design process. People talk in pictures, right? right. And, and uh, talking in pictures is sort of inherently inaccessible. There is a really good answer to this, though. I brought my laptop along that has a demo of this, and I'll just share just a couple of photos on here. Heading level five, link. Clara Valenstein, link. February 26th, button. Sunday night splurge. What I particularly like is that I feel like because of the automatic alt text, I'm getting the entire flavor of the story because it says... Link, image, image may contain pizza, food. <laughs> it's always going to say image may contain because we're not 100% confident about any of it. The confidence level has to be really high before we will, we will include it in the picture because no data is better than bad data. Mm -hmm. and. We absolutely don't want people to start ignoring the automatic alt text because they don't trust it. You know, for me, especially as not just somebody who's working at Facebook on accessibility, but also who's blind and using the product, at the heart of Facebook's mission is where accessibility lives. This is step one, down a new path, and it's down a path towards equal access to information for uh, people who have visual impairments. We want to make sure that everybody is able to get the same level of benefit and enjoyment. I think it is a, a prereq for us to achieve our mission and I'm very excited that the company gave the blessing to start this team and has continued to invest in it over the past five years. <laughs>